who doesn't love a steak rice paper wrap? I mean, the six-year-old loves them. Anyways, red pepper, cucumbers, throw them in some rice vinegar, some salt, a little sesame oil. Great. Of course, use some sesame oil to uh, cook the steak as well. Uh, always pat down your steak so that way it sears nicely. I like to score the fat and or gristle. So in this situation, the steak doesn't curl on that side. I'm just using a bag salad because it's easy and I'm tired. Uh, and I don't want to deal with cutting 100 vegetables. Uh, I would say that's a pretty decent sear for this hot plate. Yes, it's a hot plate because the motherboard burnt up on my oven, stove, whatever. So I would have to pay, let's see, $140 for uh, a new or a used refurbished motherboard or $250 for a brand new one. Plus I would have to get a new wiring harness. So let's just say I'm not doing that. I'll get a new stove eventually. Anyways, back to this thing. It was a success. Uh, I highly recommend people using rice paper more. It's really easy to actually work with. So uh, don't be scared. Just try it. Why not? This is edible. Edible? Yeah. It's a rice paper. <laughs> it's a different kind of paper. Mm. Big bite. And as Oscar explains, it is edible. And some might say my steak was overcooked, but um, that's because I was feeding it to a six-year-old as well. So it is a win. I give it a 10 out of 10.